Here is a worksheet to write decimal number as percent, right? So we got a couple of examples here, 10 of them to be specific. And what you need to do is all these decimal numbers, convert them to percent, right? Make a copy of this. Stop the video at this time and then write them as percent, okay? Here is how you could do it. Converting decimal number as percent means multiplying each by 100, you got it, percent. So times every number by 100. And that gives you the answer. So when you times any number by 100, what happens to your decimal number? It moves how much? Two places to the right because you are expecting a bigger number when you multiply. So bigger number is moving these two places to the right and so you get 25 and then your percent sign, 25%. You get it like that. So that's how you do it. So here when you multiply by 100 that means you will do times 100, right? And then it will give you percent from decimal number. Times 100 means moving decimal two places and you get 4.0 you can write four percent is that okay like that you should get how about this if you times it with 100 you get 100 percent right so let's do this one now if i times that by 100 what happens it goes two places to the right and you get 101 percent so you get 101 percent do you see that that is how it is. Now there are some small numbers. Let me do this one for you. If I times that by 100, if I times this by 100, that means 0 0.001. So it goes two places to the right and I get what? 0.1%. Do you see that? So that is 0.1%, right? Do the rest and see if you have any difficulties. That's the most simplest thing, right? Times with 100 is moving decimal to two places right and making a bigger number, writing it as percent sign, right? 4%. This will be how much? Times 100, 300%. Do you see that? This one, 999%. That means 999%, okay? And this will be 110%, correct? So like that, you should get your answer. And once you're done with this worksheet, move on to the next one. Thank you.